Yeah, I'm happy to. This is such an important question, you know, overall the role of communities in the success of conservation. And, you know, for me, there's kind of two ways that I want to answer this question. And one is with a really sincere focus on the environmental and social histories of the communities where conservation work is being done. I feel that it is extremely important that anyone who's designing a conservation initiative or project have a full understanding and acknowledgement of how communities, especially the original communities in these areas, may have been stewards of the environment in their own right. They may have had conservation principles. And in a lot of places, they likely had conservation principles that were at the core of their cultural heritage and how they used the land. In so many landscapes where conservation is done, especially so many where I've worked, we're finding that we are, we as conservationists are doing conservation work that is so, so similar to the original values that the native or indigenous community members had. And when that goes unacknowledged, it can be extremely offensive. And when it becomes acknowledged and really perpetuated, automatically we're taking the first step towards building an inclusive process.